congratulations on the show. Thank you. Um, can you talk about how you felt the first time you read the script? When I read it, I th- actually, I started reading it and I didn't have time to read the entire thing and I made time because I couldn't stop. I just found it to be so um, unusual yet relatable and so funny yet moving. It's all the things I kind of look for. It felt original, which is highly unusual. And it just says something really very honest about relationships, not only with others, but the relationship we have with ourselves, I think. It's really special. We all did. The cast, the crew, we put so much into it because it just felt um, like a real gift to all of us. You've done many roles which require an element of fearlessness. Was there any sort of trepidation on your part? Absolutely. freaking <laughs> I, mean, I look for those roles. I want to be challenged in that way. And, um, yeah, it's, a cre- it's, it's a, an unusual... Um, step to take in one's relationship but it, it, it's almost like they're going in the wrong direction to go in the right direction um, but as I said earlier you know it, it isn't just about the sex in their relationship it's it's about um, a real knowledge of, of who they are and and um, connecting deeper with themselves in order to, to create a deeper connection with each other um, but yeah some of some of the initial sex scenes were a, a little scary just because you don't you're not familiar with the other actors you're working with yet and um but i be you know i honestly did become quite used to it um i think it's a really healthy look at sex and relationships what would you like the audience to take away there's so much to take away that's the thing i love about this show it's not it's not easy you can't just say it's black and white there's it's about so many things and it depends who you are it depends where you're at in your own life as to what you'll kind of relate to in the story but i think if nothing else if people feel inspired to to really live the life they want to live not to don't be sheep we're all so asleep it takes it takes something to to wake you up and really start to live the life you want. I I think that's very common for a lot of people and that's ultimately what the story's about. Has it changed your views at all on whether it's appreciating life or...? I think I was already kind of dancing in that area and now I'm in, you know, I, I, I just love it because it's like all of these things that we, that we privately think and feel, uh, given, there's a voice given to it. Um, and I think that's a great thing, and that's the point of storytelling, is to make us feel connected. And that's what this does. So many people are like, oh my God, that's me. Or, you know, this is what I don't want to look at. And it's been very, uh, it's confronting for some people, in a good way, hopefully. Sometimes, <laughs> maybe not. Um, you know, if people don't want to look at things, but it's, it's deeper than you think. It's not, it's not just, what I want people to know is it's not just about sex. Um, that's part of it, but it's it's about connection and experiencing life in all its glory, making your experience here as rich and colourful and as profound as as you can. We're only given one life. This is it. And just one last thing. What's the best or most memorable advice you ever heard and from who? I'm terrible at these things. <laughs> Hmm. Did you have any kind of mentors before you moved over? I know you went to London first. or I never really have. Um, you know, I've worked with people that I've admired. I never wanted to emulate anyone else's career. I never wanted to, you know... I've just kind of been open and followed the yellow brick road. <laughs> well, what advice would you give to someone? I just think um, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of looking outward for self-knowledge and I actually think we all know what's best for us and I think the best I think the best thing I've learnt is actually go within when you want to figure something out you know best you know yourself quiet things down and listen thank you sure